Hey Socks, take a look. I believe I found the energy source that will be able to power our jet back home. Ha ha ha, did somebody say energy source? I'll be taking that from you, Buzz. Oh yeah? You and what army, Zerg? I've got my Cyclops mechs robots here. Take that from him, Cyclops. Give me out, I'll, I'll be taking this, Buzz. Ha 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 ha. Now we have the energy source. All right, Cyclops, let's get out of here. Oh no, Zerg took the uh, renewable energy source that we needed. I'm gonna have to call on my bigger Buzz Lightyear buddies to uh, help retrieve it. Did somebody call on Buzz? Well, good thing I've got my laser knife weapon. Big Buzz, Big Buzz! Zerg came with his Cyclops robot and it took the renewable energy source. No worries, little, little Buzz. We'll go after him. You might need more than yourself. Oh, don't worry. I've got the recruits with me. I've got Darby Steel. It's got an awesome cannon. We've got Mo Morrison. If somebody need help, you sure do. And I've got Lizzie Hawthorne. All right, I think we gotta go after this Buzz. Go after uh, this Zerg guy. Yeah, let's go after him. Ha ha ha, Cyclops. Now that we have the energy source, we'll be unstoppable. Not so fast, Zerg. Come on, Mo. Hit him with the harpoon. Oh no, he got Cyclops. Concentrate fire on Zerg. Darby, shoot, shoot one of your cannon projectiles at him. It's no use, his armor is too thick. We need Buzz. Buzz, get in there with your, with your laser sword. Alright, here we go. Oh, alright. We cut him up. He's down. Energy source is ours again. Good job, guys. All right, awesome. Ah, you guys think you defeated me? Not so fast. I'm gonna call on my giant Cyclops robot. Does somebody call on Cyclops? Get him, Cyclops. Hiya! You guys are no match for me. Oh no, I think what we need is the XL15 to come and uh, shoot some rockets at this giant robot. Knocked out his teleportation device. Great. Your evil plans have been foiled once again. This is Buzz Lightyear to Star Command. We've retrieved the energy cubes. All right, Buzz. Great job. Star Command out. To infinity and beyond. Okay, now let's check out these toys that we played with today. Welcome back to Wolf Creek Toys. The new Disney Pixar Lightyear movie is out. So what does that mean for us? It's time to check out a bunch of Lightyear toys. And let's start off with this Blast and Battle XL15. Uh, I guess it's Buzz Lightyear Starship. It's huge. Look at this. 
Let's check out the box art a little bit. So all the things that it can do in the back. There is a Buzz Lightyear that goes in it. All right, so let's take it out of the box. Okay, so here it is, out the box. It, uh, this is the main part of the ship. There are some parts that we gotta attach to it and it comes with some instructions for us to see what to do. Right, there is the, comes with the thrusters, left and right side. The other part of the wing, I guess it couldn't fit in the box so they had this come separate. This is the tip of this wing right here and some vertical stabilizers. It comes with this maybe about four inch Buzz Lightyear. His helmet comes with the, the dome so you can put it on there which is pretty cool, right? Comes off. He has a jet pack. The wings fold up, I believe. Wow, look at that. That is pretty cool. It goes onto his back. This is the right way, right? Okay, there we go. So he's got his jetpack there. So that's Buzz Lightyear. And the ship comes with a few of these projectiles. Four of them. All right, Buzz. Let's assemble your XL-15 space jet. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, assemble the rest of this spaceship. All right, so we're gonna put click on the other wing. Easier said than done. Let's see, it's in there. Okay, it's in there. Let's put on the tip of the other wing right here there we go it clicks in Let's get these the bad boys in there Okay, it's ready to go. Wow, look at this thing. So there's a lever at the back here, right? Which if you push it in, it closes everything down. Okay, so this is the XL15. It comes in a light blue and off-white markings. Here is the Star Command logo, the name, the number of the ship, XL15. Check out the inside of the cockpit. This is where Buzz Lightyear sits. The engine parts and the thrusters are com coming gray. And. Uh, Cockpit visor is in a yellow tint. Okay, let's get Buzz Light here in here and see what it does. Okay, so this is how it works. We place Buzz inside the cockpit and we make sure the wings are folded like so. Right inside the cockpit, there is a place for his foot and two pegs. So you kind of stick them right in there. Take this piece inside the cockpit and make sure it goes around Buzz's waist to kind of clamp him in there. Oops. 
Gotta make sure the wings are folded, of course, right? Otherwise, it's not gonna work. Then we push the thing in the back in to get everything. Oops. Oh, I see. So buzz kind of buzz kind of lays down in there, and it closes. And we're able to close the windshield. There we go. Buzz is now inside the XL15. He's ready to go fight Zerg and his many minions. Right? So when he flies into battle, he's able to pop out of the cockpit. Buzz Lightyear to the rescue! Haha, <laughs> that's pretty cool. Let's see that again. Buzz Lightyear, Star Command, to the rescue. Okay, let's take a closer look at this buzz actually. It's pretty detailed. So they made this new buzz in the new Lightyear movie way less cartoony looking. It looks more militant, I would say. Uh, this the shield, his uh dome dome helmet comes on and off, like I said before. And these wings fold up. It must be a button to press and they kind of go like this too when you need it to I'm not sure okay. the knees bend you got the ball joint on the hip okay his uh, waist is on a swivel so it turns his shoulder is on a ball joint ball and hinge and so his is his uh, elbow he can grasp items with his hands and the head also turns so that's pretty cool and so that's the XL15 Buzz Lightyear Jet toy set that comes with this Buzz Lightyear oh wait let's check out the cannons the projectiles let's see where do they shoot out of they come out of, oh all right so let's close this cockpit up okay so the projectiles go inside the wings right here you could do two at a time let's see this is the other one on the other side and how do they fire okay so I figured it out there's these buttons on the wings that you press it fires off the projectiles. Let's take a look. Oh wow, those come out really fast. Okay, next let's check out this recruits to the rescue set with four figures and it comes with uh, accessories for each of them looks like a helmet and a weapon this is made by Mattel let's take a look at the box pretty cool box it looks like it's in the shape of some kind of space shuttle or vehicle transport that they have in the movie right we can't watch, wait to watch the movie here at Wolf Creek Toys okay, so it comes with Izzy Hawthorne Mo Morrison, of course Buzz Lightyear, Socks, and Darby Steel. Alright, let's take them out the box and check them out. Okay, so here it is out the box. Let's take them out.
All right, let's check out this Buzz Lightyear again. So this Buzz Lightyear is wearing his traditional green and white spacesuit with some gray areas on the shoulder and uh, stomach. He doesn't have his purple hoodie on. Here is here he is with his shield up. And here is socks, his little cat companion. He can store his weapon here on the side, which is pretty cool. Okay, so that's Buzz Lightyear. Okay, next let's check out Izzy Hawthorne. Okay, she is one of the recruits that I believe will help Buzz save the day. Her spacesuit or her armor is uh, different shades of brown with a very dark gray underneath. She has these shoulder pads, uh, arm armor here, and she's got these really cool looking boots. I right. think you can, okay, so let's take a look of her with her helmet on, right? This is a really cool looking helmet. It goes right over here. Oh, wow. That's, that's really nice. I like that. I like how easy that went on too. This is her weapon. Right. I think she can either store her weapon here on her back. You could even put it, I believe, right here on her hip. And of course she can definitely hold it. Which is always easier said than done. But yeah, that's uh that's pretty cool. Right. Is he hot going? I love the helmet, look at that. Wow. They they look um threatening or pretty strong or something <laughs> with the helmets on. So that's Izzy Hawthorne. Okay, next let's check out Mo Morrison. Wow, he's pretty tall. So he comes in a very light blue almost purplish armor again with the dark gray underneath he's got dark blue gloves uh, light blue and brown boots and again he's got all the same armor they, they come with this pretty cool uh, pretty well detailed belt right here okay so let's put his helmet on and see how he looks oh that's pretty cool wow the helmet is similar to the helmet on Izzy Hawthorne, just in a different color. They almost look like robots when they got the helmets on, right? This is his weapon. Looks like some kind of futuristic uh, harpoon gun. I guess that's what he does. And again, similar to Izzy, the weapons can be placed on the back can be placed on the hip and of course they can hold it if they are cooperative enough to do so which they are not but yeah that's pretty cool this is Mo Morrison right okay last but not least in this set is Darby Steel all right, I guess Darby Steel is the older one of the group. Comes with green armor, with of course the dark gray and two different color boots, a green and a brown one. Right, it's got a brown utility belt. The smallest one's got the biggest weapon. Right, they always do that. That's always uh, that's always the case. And it looks like a, I guess, futuristic bazooka cannon. And like the other ones, you can place in the back, on the hip. But wow, this weapon would be so heavy to be carrying on your hip. I'm not sure if anybody should be doing that. Right comes with a pretty cool green helmet which is similar to the others 
Wow, look at that. I'm really loving this set actually. They all look pretty cool with their gear and the helmets on. Alright, let me get this weapon on here. Okay, so yes, this is like a bazooka-like weapon. Okay, Darby Steel holds and launches from the shoulder. Okay, so that is the Lightyear Recruits to the Rescue set. Next, let's take a look at this 12-inch Buzz Lightyear. All right, let's take him out the box. Okay, so here he is, the 12 inch Buzz Lightyear. He is pretty fully articulated, his head turns. He's got the ball joints for the shoulders so that the arms can move in every direction. Ball and hinge, right? He's got the ball and the hinge for the elbows, the wrist turns. Right, his feet, his hip is on a hinge and ball. Okay, wow. They actually added a waist turning feature right there too, right? The knee is on a hinge and ball and the ankle turns. So you could position his feet in different directions. Right. He is actually in a different kind of color scheme. He is not wearing the green. He has on the very light purplish blue with the off-white and the gray gear on. His uh, hoodie is like a light blue, right? So this is pretty cool, a pretty cool looking Buzz Lightyear. Okay, moving right along. Next, let's take a look at this Cyclops, All right? We got he's one of the bad guys in the movie. All right, let's take him out the box and check him out. Okay, so here's Cyclops out the box. Right, he is a really cool yellow robot with gray markings and some red trim. Yeah. They call him Cyclops because he only has one eye. One of his hands is like a claw. He comes with two projectiles. Right. And of course, they go in here, one of them. Let's see. Oh, wow. Just like the XL15, it shoots out really fast. Also comes with this gray disc. They're saying this is a teleportation disc and it goes in here. I guess that's part of the play features of this, right? He's very articulate, very movable and posable. Right. A very Fearsome opponent for Buzz. Let's we'll see that projectile come out again. Okay, next let's take a look at this miniature ver uh, XL02. It is a different uh, starship that Buzz flies in the movie. All right? It's very small. It comes with a very small figurine. I guess it's part of this uh, miniature set. All right, let's take a look. Let's take it up. Let's take it out the box and check it out. 
Okay, so here is the little miniature jet plane. Right? Pretty cool, the cockpit opens. But it's very small figure. I'd say he's not even an inch, almost maybe an inch, close. He can go inside there. If you guys can't even see him, he goes in there. Close the cockpit. Right. This has wheels that come down. It's pretty cool. Okay, next let's check out these Imaginex uh, Lightyear toys. Right here we have Zerg, the leader of the bad guys, and one of his minions, Cyclops. Okay. So let's take it out of the box here and check it out. Okay, so these are the, you know, like all other Imaginex toys, right? Same size. You know, uh, limited movement, but very easy to play with. This Cyclops comes with this shield. Alright, pretty cool. Take a look at Zerg. Right, so we all remember Zerg from all the Toy Story movies where he is Buzz's nemesis and actually turns out he's Buzz's dad they say. So that's pretty funny. So he's wearing his, he's like a purple robot. I don't know if he's actually a person in a suit but this is how he looks. So pretty cool. We got two of those guys there. And next, let's check out this other Imagine Next, which we have Buzz not in his uh, spacesuit and his companion socks. And there's this thing in here, which I believe is like an energy cube or energy thing that they need to get in the movie. All right, so let's take it out of the box and check it out. Okay, so here we go. It's pretty cool, this is the first time we see Buzz not in his spacesuit, right? He's like a regular dude. And this is like a piece of energy, almost an energy prism. I believe this is what he's trying to find, or he's trying to find a way to have en enough energy to power his space shuttle back somewhere. But if anybody knows, you know, the story of the new movie, you know, please comment below and let me know. So these are the Imaginex figures. So let's take one final look at all the toys we got today. Right? In anticipation of the new Buzz Lightyear movie. So we have the XL-15 Space Shuttle. It comes with this Buzz Lightyear figure. We have all these other, we had the recruit pack that came with another Buzz Lightyear. Came with Lizzie Hawthorne. Mo Morrison. And Darby Steel. Right? Let's put Darby Steel on this side. Okay, then we opened up this big Cyclops, 12 inch Buzz Lightyear, so we're going back there, you can't see his head. Let's make him sit or something. Lightyear. We opened up this mini XL02 and then we last but not least we opened up a couple of Imaginex figures. So this was our toy haul from the new Buzz Lightyear movie. That's all for now. Bye!
Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe for more videos.